We all got cut off on that video, so we'll start a new video. This is MJ Welch Auction 121, Estate Auction 121. We were showing you the TV. Here we have a Bose surround sound, excuse me, Bose speaker. We have a Samsung Blu-ray, and we have a Samsung woofer. Um, Bluetooth woofer, so um, the whole set there is a lot of money. You get it at a great price. Uh, this picture, unusual, is about six feet tall. You have to look at the measurements to tell you what it is, but that was in her bedroom. Look at this floor lamp. And there's a vintage lamp with the old vintage shape and great, great shape. Bent wood magazine stand, a modern white chair, very comfortable too. <clears throat> um, this was also, a, she used uh, as a little desk, but uh, this is a Jonathan Adler piece here. Um, now below it is a box of vintage aprons. If you like to cook or just, it's uh, an array of old vintage aprons. <clears throat> On top, we have a box lap full of stoppers. Oh gosh. From perfume bottle to wine to decanters, um, stoppers, just all kind of stoppers. Next, we got a uh, dresser tray, a mirror dresser tray, a little modern style. Got the hand grips on the side, uh, the little jewelry boxes up here. There's some little bit of jewelry. We're going to sell bag lot. And then uh, that's the Chippendale table and chairs. I'll show you in a minute. We have a Deco bookends. This is Deco, 1930s. It's a cellarette. If you don't know what a cellarette is, door opens up, you get glasses, and you put your booze inside. I got to get the key for it. Okay, uh, again, from France, these wall sconces. They're very heavy, by the way, but they're nice. <clears throat> okay, and this one, unusual box, she had tons of shower curtains. So, if you kind of has a lot of Shower uh, bathrooms, there's a whole box of shower curtains, just full. Couple nice chairs. This box is scarves, uh, just full of um, old scarves. A lot of them are silk. Up, up here is the armor. Uh, probably 1930s. It breaks down, of course, into many pieces, so it's easy to transport. <clears throat> I don't know. Vaseline glass hanging light. I wish you could see this. Well, I have a picture on the web, but that's Vaseline glass, 1920s, came from a bordello. Okay, this is 1920s or 30s French um, hallway sofa. It's got the uh, locks on the side. The inside's got a shelf and a storage on each side. These are hand-blown, these two pieces. 
This is the king size Italian headboard, 1950, I would say 1960. That's wood, made of wood. And there's your Greek print. And I'm gonna come back to that. Um, got another Bose soundbar, um, head bust, Italian table, mother of pearl, uh, top. Um, this is, again, French wall lights with the beads and the light. I didn't take the time to put them together. Beads need to be cleaned. These have been in a box for years, but that's what they are. Um, they're wall sconces or light sconces. On the table, which is a uh, Chippendale, we have this uh, vintage uh, dresser tray with perfume bottles, and that's a cigarette case. <clears throat> the china, we have a lot of china. This is Hacha Rudner, 12 play set. Then we go into purses. I have vintage purses. Um, but, um, Gosh, I wanted to show you this one. Look at that one. Interesting. That was a box lot. Best thing though is this chair from France. It's a deco chair. In great shape, very comfortable. Um paper shredder. Um, this is full of fixtures, just a mix match. That's a, a picture frame. Box light here. <clears throat> this is a great box light. You got your Italian uh, jewelry case. Uh, this is Perfume bottle from Italy. Again, the stopper is missing. Uh, these are gray from France. These are metal uh, vintage pieces there. Um, uh, this is great. Little ashtrays. Um, more in the deco period. Tassels, <clears throat> great tassel, and you see that's made out of metal, but if you could see how intricate that's wound, that's really a nice piece there. Over here we have a new box. We got uh, spice tubes. These tubes, we have caps for them, but you can put your spices in there, and then we have the new stuff here. Um, this Chippendale, I don't want to ignore it. The table, the chairs are great, great backs. Okay, I'm gonna move over here. Get that little kid's um, wicker set table. This chair is so well made. This is well made furniture. I would say that was made in the Philippines because they really know how to do their stuff there. Okay, this is neat. Not seen this one. Ice bucket. But he's got the little cat. <laughs> I mean, I thought this was neat. Okay, but that's an ice bucket. Uh, above it, again, a 1920s 
French all handmade. Um, mirror, now that, of course, that mirror is not as old as the frame, but look at the bevel on that. That's over an inch bevel. You'll never see that made in America like that. Uh, the Picasso print, another Picasso print. Uh, jewelry box, we don't do that because the drawer opens when you do the lid and there's some jewelry in there. Vintage glasses, uh, there's probably 24 karat gold on there. This is uh, brass, two, two hanging brass grapevines. Very rare. Okay. This is granite top. It's a modern bar, mirror on the sides, and then the front. And then you drop this down, and you can put your glasses. And it's mirrored back and sides. And of course, there's the inside. The condos, when I first sold it eight years ago, the contents, I think the, con the condo had woodwork that cost more than the condo. The walls were just something, all imported wood, I understand, from Canada. But they said the woodwork cost more than the condo, so the condo sold around. 250 275 back then um today it just sold i think for a million two now look at that face you have got to wake up in the morning and put a smile on your face with the big boy need him okay cups and saucers the old a box lot of vintage uh, frames. Okay, that's a cigarette lighter. Uh, this can be like a little um, hand towel in the bathroom to prop up, or you could use it for mail, envelopes, whatever. These are brass, vintage brass picture frames. Look at the intricate work on them. They've been stamped i'm sure uh grapes uh these are light bulb colors covers it's for your smaller ones uh, here's a deco cigarette lighter um excuse me cigarette holder very deco hand beaded flowers these birds are like Christmas tree light bulbs, you know, they, that size. Um, those stoppers. These birds that take batteries and they chirp. Um, nice finios, um, tassels. It's a mix, uh, just a mix over here is more up-to-date modern uh, kitchenware. Uh, this is a nice set. Uh, I think I still got the box. This is new. Yeah. This is so you can see the name. This is brand new. We took it out of the box. So you're getting the tray and the glasses and the shaker. No vintage piece. Uh, you got Tony the Tiger, and you got Huckleberry Finn Spoons. Here's for the kids. This is a pride and joy. This is a cocktail shaker. Um, this is the blimp. Um, remember 1940s, the Hemingbird blimp? But you can see it's a... Uh, Okay. Uh, knives. We have knives. 
This woman had three sets of knives. I'm going to turn you around where you can see who it is. Another box lot here. This is uh, mostly new items. New KitchenAid mixer. Um, your little measuring cups are new. Can openers new. Um, this uh, gripper grips a battery powered grips uh, tops of lids. Hard to unscrew. That's to give you a better grip. A little dicer. Okay, let's move to this. This is granite top. Um, was used in a restaurant. The woodwork on the back sides looks like that. It's a trash bin. You can roll it around, put it where they want. And then we go to these etched glasses, these cordials. Um, they almost have a Cambridge design to them, but don't know for sure. Okay, this is a, like a 1940s waterfall chest. Um, very heavy, but look how new it looks. Yep, well taken care of. Um, because we're not doing in-house auctions now, we're going to sell this rack of folding chairs. Uh, you'll have to look on the sheet and see how many there are. Um, there's uh, about nine of these indoor-outdoor chairs. Restaurants in Florida use these chairs. There's armchairs we're going to be selling, so each one's a different number. Um, hair cutting, whether you're in the business, want to be in the business, or you want it for home, nice little hair cutting chair. It's got the golden oak armrest, and we have a box lot just full of hair tools, scissors, brushes, edgers, combs, blow dryer. There's even a vintage uh, barber vac. The barbers always had a vac behind them. Okay, that's a box lot. Chair-wise, um, we have six of these great-looking chairs. Let me get the sunlight coming in. is affecting the picture a little bit next to it. We have Italian lamp table, mother of pearl top. It's a little TLC, but look at the shade. Still in great shape. Okay, let me take you around here. Vaseline glass, Vaseline, Vaseline glass. Um, what is this? Nortaki. This is Nortaki. These pieces, pickle jar. In each pickle jar, caster, whatever you want to call it, grapefruit knives, um, Linux. I got all kind of Linux. Um, there's a silver overlaid pitcher, a couple of vintage teapots. Uh, we're selling this together. I think that's Stouffer's, and that's uh, Picard. Um, let me get, I have some of these. Um, this is a um, knife set right here. Okay. Okay, silver overlay, some more of these um, knives, uh, belt buckles, Picture frame, bag of little picture frames, bar, box lot of bar items, jewelry boxes, costume jewelry, more jewelry boxes. Um, this is new, it's like 1920, could be 30. Night light, Japanese light light. Really, I'm, I'm not seeing that one either. Uh, here's another modern um, coffee set or tea set. <clears throat> um, just older pieces, tile clock, frame, 
heavy frame, um, uh, you'll need to replace the movement, but you may like to. Um, this is uh, camless. It's got the silver inlaid and rare to have the knife sharpener with it. Um, picture frames. We have picture frames. Uh, again, vintage serving sets. Um, these are uh, um, bottoms up shot glasses. This is a real McCoy, patent numbers on it. There's a lot of repos, but this one, these are real. Uh, very deco. This is a very nice bread knife. It's an old piece with an ivory handle. Dresser set. Van Briggle back there. We got a, a bridal basket there. This is unusual from France. This is like a uh, ostrich in bronze, and the little put your little perfume ring trays and stuff. Unusual little piece. This is a more modern piece. Very nice. Uh, paperweight, big paper. This hand blown vase here. Very nice piece, that's hand blown. Okay, here we go to the table. Let's see if the sun doesn't bother us. We put these chairs around it. Now these chairs are vintage, but the table is like French 1870s rosewood. So this is, we just put the chairs around it for show. A little cast iron mailbox. Um, Nordic track um, exercise bike. Uh, bronze, you can't see them with this side. Bronze ele elephants. Very heavy. Don't know what you use them for, but. And we're going to sell the shop back. And also, a Mishibishi, we bought five of these. I uh, was going to use this one in the back of the store, but uh, these are about 1800 through fine 117. Um, it's a, for a split air. It's a heat pump for a split air unit. Um, be a good buy for anybody who gets that. Um, 24 foot extension. These are original Hunter Fans, these two. Uh, in the brass coating, um, cast iron, uh, 1970s. Um, we sell the pair together. This is more modern. These are some ceiling fans we were gonna put upstairs in their building. Look at the blades on that one. Uh, that goes to that fan. Then we have the Vanderbilt. We had three of those. There's the blades over there. Uh, we were going to put these upstairs, but like I said, we sold the building. Okay, with this, been in the basement for about 25 years. Bought all this, we thought we were going to use it. Had it sandblasted. It's powder coated with a primer, so you can paint it any. Uh, color you want, and it has the acorn pattern in it. Uh, we got a couple eight-foot ladders that we're selling. Um, I was going to put the sink upstairs, 1940s. Uh, nice little sink, pedestal sink. Um, and then uh, if you need security door, I don't know if the sun is going to affect it. Um, we bought five of these. I used two on the building. But uh, I've got places for your locks over there. But this is nice. Also, uh, we have eight foot and what's that, 12 foot ladders. Um, 
These are bronze, and you mount them on the wall, can hang plants if you want to. Um, got a little roll around, you stand on it, and it doesn't roll anymore. A uh, little step, and a new four-wheeler. And I think that's about it. I hope you enjoy what you've seen, and I hope you enjoy the auction. Thank you. Have a great auction.